Hi, I'm David for Lark in the Morning, and I'm going to talk to you about our traditional design, a goatskin headed dumbek, or dotabuka. Uh, this particular model is made in Pakistan of heavy brass with a nickel plating on it with uh, pretty decent quality uh, screw threading. Uh, the, the lugs are nice and rounded so they won't hurt your hand when you're playing on it. And for those of us who've been around the Middle Eastern scene for a long time, we remember these as being very similar to the small Syrian metal drums from the uh, late 60s and 1970s. And what these are, with the goat skin head and with this particular goblet-shaped body, which is wider on top, gives you a very narrow throat and opening up, um, it gives you a, a deep dum and a high tech with quite a wide difference between the two in pitch. And with the natural goat skin head, you get a very old-fashioned, warm-sounding drum. So you wind up getting a drum that has a nice deep dum, nice text with a little bit of ring from the brass, and good snaps because of the, uh, the square-type rim allows you to do the snapping techniques. And it's not really a very... Um, it's a, not a heavy drum because it's not a big drum, although the brass is substantial and feels good and is not prone to denting. It's very strong. So it's a very comfortable, easy drum to deal with, uh, particularly for those of you who want a, a contrast in sound to, say, the big Alexandria or a Goharit type drums, or are looking for that older fashioned sound, need to reinforce something, or looking for a particular type of tone color. Anyway, uh, the skins are easy enough to replace. Remove the four lugs. Um, if you can get a head that's already pre-mounted on the little ring underneath here, it just slips right back on. If you have to mount your own, you save the metal ring that's under here uh, that the skin is wrapped around. Wet a new goat skin, wrap it all around properly, tie it down, let it dry, you're good to go. Um, and also with the little lugs here, you can tie a scarf or attach some kind of strap mechanism to it and this makes it a very easy drum for walking around at Ren fairs or that sort of thing. Anyway, thank you very much. I appreciate uh, the attention and the introduction to the uh, traditional design uh, goat skin headed dumbbell.